what's up y'all so we're back with another video and today since this is day two of me recording this video we're gonna do a shein 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 try on haul i really need somebody to give me the enunciation for this brand because i really don't know but anyway um this is my second purchase from them and i am in love okay i did like a whole loungewear set the first order and then this order i kind of just bought like just clothes just to have ever since i joined the navy i haven't really bought myself clothes but now i ain't in the navy i ain't got no uniform i can wear what i want to wear what i want to wear to work outside inside around the house wherever to work out i can wear clothes i can wear what i want to wear so I'm happy about that. So now I feel like there's a purpose for me to spend my money on all these websites. Because before, I just didn't see the need because I had to wear a uniform Monday through Friday, sometimes Saturday and Sunday for 8 to 12 hours a day. So I just want to show y'all some pieces that I got. So this first piece is a sweater. I thought the sweater was going to be much thicker than what it was, but that's okay. Um, it's the white sweater. I got this thing all types of inside out. Wow. All right. First out piece is this little white sweater. Um, I thought it was going to be much less see-through as it is, but that's okay. Um, all I got to do is wear like a nice little tank top underneath it, black bra, as you saw in the video. I think this is really cute. You can dress this up, dress it down, lounge around the house with it. I love the neckline because it's just perfect enough. Like if you wanted to try to wear it off the shoulder, like it's just perfect enough. Um, it's a really stretchy material. And when I tell y'all this knit is so soft. It doesn't say um, what the exact material is, or does it? Yeah, it says it's 100% cotton. Um, I love this sweater. I have three sweaters by Shein, but this is the only one that technically was not in the loungewear. So, 10 out of 10 would recommend. By the way, all these sizes are in a size small, just for future reference. The next outfit I have is this cute little um, button up with this floral print on the shoulders. Like how cute, oh, how cute is that? Like that's really, really cute. Like I could see myself wearing this like springtime with some white pants, even though I didn't do that in the video. Um, you can wear, definitely wear this with some white pants or any kind of colored jean. You can pretty much wear this with and it'll pop, especially if you pick like one of the colors that's in this top. Um, I wish it was a little bit more stretchier and a little bit longer on my waistline, but that's okay. We're going to make it work. It is 65% is polyester and 35% cotton, but I think they lie. I think it's all I think it's all cotton. This thing don't stretch. That's it. Um, it just don't stretch. It just, it just is what it is. But I think this is so cute. My hair look a hot mess, y'all. Wow. I'm going to wash it soon. Don't worry. Anyway. Next outfit was this cute little... Oh, by the way. All the outfits or all these items, I'm going to put the link um, down in the description box in case you want to get it yourself and you don't feel like scrolling through their site trying to find it. It's going to be in the description box. So that's why I'm not naming the names. But this cute little leopard print button down, oh, I didn't think I would like it, but I absolutely love this top. Um, my mom had some shoes like this back in the day and i used to always think that those shoes were so cute and guess what they made a top like them um it's a very i say it's like a very silky material it feels it's 100 percent polyester um 
it feels really really nice if you want to wear it during colder times i highly suggest putting a tank top underneath it because it is a little thin but being that it's this thin and it's like this silky kind of material makes it great for if you want to wear it like um late spring early summer right before it gets like too too hot but this is really really cute i loved this piece um i can see myself dressing it up dressing it down or even just going to work with it which was the point most of these clothes were to buy for the versatility of being able to wear it to a brunch or lunch or some kind of event and then turn around and taking it and going to work so that's what we were going that's what that's kind of where we were going with these outfits so then you have this cute little top oh my god my favorite this top is my favorite i was not expecting it to be like this sexy um and prints aren't usually my thing if you look at my closet most of my stuff is really really plain but this print it really stood out to me they had another one that was like black and white or blue and white um but this print really stood out to me the most and i think it's just so cute so what you do is uh oh you basically you just tie it up right beneath the breast line and there's two there's two ties and you pretty you can you see it more in the back nope but anyway you see right right here there are two strings and you pretty much just tie those up to fit according to your waistline and that's how you get this little style and then it flares out at the bottom and then these sleeves they're so cute you can especially with the elastic at the wrist you can scrunch these up wear them at the wrist it doesn't matter this outfit is just really really cute this material is also um 65 cotton 35 polyester again springtime early summer it's a vibe this i would not wear to work though this is like someone like girls night like not girls night oh well, yeah girls night or um like going to a brunch or some kind of um event that requires you to be like trendier um definitely not work <laughs> definitely not work um this top here oh my god i was not expecting this top to be such high quality i just love the dual just like the half and half design on the back it's completely black but i just love this little half and half design um and you can tell like the part this side is much more silkier than this side this side is thick like you can actually you could probably wear this now like with the weather the way that it's been kind of cold um and it'll still keep you pretty warm at least for the black side um the silky side you kind of sol this is 95 percent polyester five percent spandex and it's definitely stretchy like this definitely has some spandex in it but it's so cute and then the little belt to tie it off so professional i would definitely wear this to work with some black slacks um and top it off with like some um some black heels or maybe even some blush heels i don't have any blush heels but i would if i had some but i don't so um we're gonna talk about these jeans okay so i am a jean person i wear jeans all year round 365 days a year don't care if it's hot don't care if it's cold i wear jeans all the time and i had these really really cute white pair of jeans back in high school that got stolen and i never kind of replaced them um i'm always looking to buy new jeans but i'm always skeptical usually i always either go for american eagle or levi's i don't really deviate from the two they might be some old navy jeans in there especially like during my postpartum and pregnancy time frame i definitely bought old navy jeans because they were stretchy i don't really trust other companies jeans so i went on a limb with these white ones and i will say I was so happy that I went with these white jeans. They're really, really stretchy. Um, the material is thick enough 
to where you can't see through the white jeans, but it's not like hot. Um, the only thing that I would recommend um, is if you're on the shorter side, like me, you will have to cuff the bottom because I'm so short and they don't offer a, a 24 short. I, actually, I don't even know how they, how do they do these sizings? Yeah, it's just a small. They didn't offer a small short or a small long or anything like that. So either hem the bottom to your liking because it's going to make it look like the stacked sweatpants a little bit or you just probably just need to cuff it. So it's up to you. These are entirely wrinkled. Um, good thing I'm not wearing them no time soon. But these are really, really cute. Um, I would pair these with this top or I would pair them with this top. Just, just to give y'all some ideas of what I'm thinking of in my head about these outfits and stuff. So next we have this romper. And when I tell y'all, I was so excited, but I was a little disappointed. I was not expecting, just how I just said those white jeans, the pants were long. The romper, the pants were short. So they kind of look like capris in a way. Um, but that's okay because I don't I don't see myself wearing this, uh, this romper with flats anyway. Typically, I'll wear it with heels, and when you're wearing, like, um, capris with heels, it doesn't look as bad, but I just don't like capris with flats or anything like that. So, I would wear these with, like, a black um, open toe, like, stiletto kind of heel and things like that. And then the belt, it really just ties it off, especially in the waist, um, just to give, like, definition of where this design meets the black I think it's really really cute um oh the material duh um this is if I can find it oh 100% polyester um and it also has a zipper on the side to help you get in and out um just know if you're wearing this and you gotta go to the bathroom sweetie you're just gonna be naked on the toilet like I think all rompers pretty much make you naked on the toilet when you got to use the bathroom. But this one is just, this one's a little over the top. I'm just like, y'all could have put the zipper like somewhere else. But that's where they, that's where they put it. I wouldn't have put it there, but that's where they put it. But anyway, it's still cute. I really, really like it. And last but not least, um, I bought this shirt for work. I thought it would have went with the leopard print shoes that I already own, but they don't. Um, this top is darker than the shoes that I own. So I would just wear these with some black boot, like booties or some cognac boots. Um, and I think this is just really, really cute. It's really simple. It has small detail right here with this extra little um, cross of fabric in the V cut. I think it's just, I think it just actually ties off this piece really, really well. Um, it is long sleeve and the sleeves, these sleeves don't crunch up like the other ones do, but this is definitely a cute work top. You can dress this up by putting a blazer on it, or you can just dress it down and wear this with some black slacks and some black heels and still look rep like, what am I trying to say? Still look representable. Is that the right word? Representable. Um, I know this video is really short in comparison to all my other videos. Um, I do plan on doing more try-on hauls if you guys are interested on some try-on haul outfit ideas or some lookbook ideas. Let me know down in the comment section below. And i love it if you hit that subscribe button and give me a thumbs up. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye!